Hello everyone, this is Sharmin Khan from Milky Way Art Design. Um, first, I want to show you something. I was planning on mixing some paint or pigments and then I opened my new subs from Piggy. This is called Egotistical. Oh my gosh. Let me show you. It's like pure magic. I hope you guys can see this. It's so pretty. Anyway, I just wanted to show this to you. And the other one is Hoity Toity. Let me show you this one. Oh, see the beauty. Honestly, sometimes when I see a really pretty color, it makes me feel like I want to cry. Literally, these two colors are making me cry. Like it's so pretty. I cannot explain how beautiful it is. I'm going to mix them now. I'm going to mix very little because they are so expensive. Oh my gosh. Let me close it. Again, this is hoity twitty. This is ego testicle. And again, I see why these are these expenses. Oh my my. When you mix them, it looks kind of dull, but as it dries, it will come around, trust me. As I'm mixing them, I can see they are very high quality pigment. Now I am mixing my pigments with Josonia varnish, and once it's mixed well, I will add my pouring medium. So this is a 10 inch by 10 inch tile and my base coat is going to be this yellow. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So, I have some paints mixed here. This one is called Quintacridon Crimson. some violet rain and 
is the new sub egotistical on the top okay next one I am going to start with it's Piggy Echeveria I don't know how to pronounce this excuse me maybe a tad bit of parakeet Maybe a lagoon. And hoity toity on the top. So I added the hoity to the SUPs on the top basically. So for this particular bloom, all the pigments are from TLP. I'm going to use both white and black cell activator Did not do a good job on blowing. So this is what I have and as you can see the colors are so pretty it's to die for so I'm thinking of doing some modifications and um, probably not too much because I just want to test the color that was my thing for today.
wow so what i'm going to do is i'm going to let it dry and then i'll come back and show you brag you about the colors oh my gosh if you can catch it on the camera i don't know oh my gosh so pretty it's worth it i'm telling you people 55 dollars but it's worth it now let's do some modifications here and there to enhance the composition and the tool that i'm using it's a bamboo kebab skewer from my kitchen Just minimum amount of modification to enhance the composition. Okay, let's let it dry and we'll get back together. Let me move it to a different spot. Here is the dry result. As you can see, it's been sitting and curing and you can see all the shimmers and the glitters. Once it cures, um, I am going to resin it. See on this side it looks green, then it looks blue. And the other one gives this purple shade. It's really pretty. So my plan is to resin it later on. Thank you so much for joining me today. So until next time, bye.